Hey, it's Tim. How are you? I hope your day's going good. Today is not hike day. It's been work day, but now it's lunch day. And today we're gonna do a little food review. Um, I found a restaurant here in town and it's called Rehydrated Dehydrated Backpacker Food Made Fresh For You. So basically what it is is they will sell you backpacker food, uh, rehydrate it for you, you know, do all that, do the hard work, and you get to try it out and eat it. It's fantastic, and it's right down here. Um, we're almost there, we're gonna go through, they've got a drive through so we're gonna go through the drive through and get us some lunch, okay? See what they got that's new. They sell all kinds of cool stuff. It's rehydrated, dehydrated backpacker food just for you. All right, we're gonna, we're almost there. I'll see you in a minute. Hi, and welcome to rehydrated, dehydrated backpacker meals for you. How may I help you? Uh, yeah, just a second here. Let me let me look at the menu real good. Sure, take all the time you need. Only good vibes here. Take your time. Uh, do you got anything you'd recommend? Anything new? Yeah, we have a new good-to-go meal. It's called Breakfast Hash. It's brand new. Oh, that sounds good. I'm in the mood for some breakfast. Can you tell me what's in it? Yeah, it's got uh, onion, dried butternut squash, feta cheese, pasteurized milk cultures, salt, dried carrot, garlic, dried potato flakes, extra virgin olive oil, spinach, rosemary, sea salt, dried thyme, dried oregano, and black peppercorn. It's all food. It's all food. Notice how many you can pronounce. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you know what? That sounds pretty good. I think I'll get that. Oh, and this time, could you take the oxygen absorber out of the packet? Last time you left it in there and I kind of cracked the tooth. Okay, coming right up. Uh, do you have a spoon, long-handled spoon or spork in the vehicle with you today, sir? Uh, yeah, I do, right here. Okay, can you tell me if that's uh, bamboo? titanium or is it just uh, aluminum uh, I think it's aluminum it's a sea to summit why uh, around here we like to just judge what kind of backpacker you are thank you that's weird all right thank you sir please go ahead and pull forward Hi. Thanks. Ooh, hot, 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 hot. Thank you. Let's go find a place to eat this, huh? And see if it's any good. Should I put my seatbelt on? I think I will. All right, here we go. Click. All right, I found a spot, beautiful spot here near the uh, the harbor. I spent a lot of time down here, I guess. This beautiful park under these trees and this fantastic Japanese uh, bell thing, Bob, and these palm trees, and it's fantastic. And here we have the breakfast hash from Good to Go proudly made in Maine. This is a breakfast hash, butternut squash with feta, spinach and rosemary, handcrafted in our own kitchen in small batches with clean ingredients. Good to go. I like these because it's just enough. Uh, just enough. It's one, it's one serving per pouch, you know? And this one's gluten-free, vegetarian. They have a ton of different flavors and kinds um, that you can get. This one I got, of course, at the fast food, dehydrated, rehydrated food shop store drive through which was fantastic these are cool um ingredients uh notice how many you can pronounce onion dried butternut squash feta cheese uh dried carrots garlic dried potato flakes extra virgin olive oil spinach rosemary sea salt dried thyme dried oregano and black peppercorn i like that i like that good stuff i like to eat as much as i can i mean uh, as healthy as i can right this does have 760 milligrams of sodium, uh, 12 grams of fat. Six of those are saturated fats, zero trans fats. That's a funny word. Uh, and 360 calories. 
Um, not too terribly bad, but it should be pretty good. Um, yeah, so we're gonna try it. We're gonna try it. I like these, like I said, because it's just the right amount. And this cost me about $8.50. Um, so uh, not the cheapest ones, but also not the most expensive. I've had some others that are pretty expensive. Let's give it a go here, it should be done. Now I need to get my aluminum. I think it's aluminum, I don't even know what this is. It's a Cedar Summit Spork. It's gray, it's metallic, it scoops the food. And I can stab, I've never actually had to stab anything with the forky thing on here. Uh, it's always been a spoon used device. But let me see if I can show you the innards, the innards of this bag as we're here in the wilderness. Well, not really, because the fire truck just drove by. But let's see if we can get it inside. There it is. That's the inside. You can make out quite a bit of that. You see the little black dog around here? No, I didn't. I've been sitting here for a while, too. Lots of ducks, though. That's all right. I hope you find your dog. And I'll keep, where are you guys at? All over, all over the place. All right. That guy's cool. Hey, there's an airplane going by. That's not just an airplane going by. There's a military base right across the water right there, and it's like a jet taking off or something. Anyway, we're going to give this a go now that we have seen it. Let's see. Ooh, it does look... Here it is. Let's give it a go. <laughs> Hotter than a wet rock in June. All right, it's good. That's a flavor. I'm not going to come out and say that it's tastes like a breakfast hash like when I taste a breakfast hash I'm thinking potatoes and eggs and sausage things like that it's not like that at all it's just a hash all kinds of stuff mixed together and of course you can eat it anytime mm -hmm. totally good totally good and they took the oxygen of that they took the oxygen absorber out, so I don't go biting into that. That's good. I like it. I'm going to sit here and eat this for a few minutes. You know, you shouldn't talk with your mouth full. But this is, this is good. It's a good thing about a couple of them at the drive-thru. No, this is just, this is plenty of food. And I'll tell you what's fantastic is when you get like, for the most part, it's hash, right? So it's all mixed together. And every once in a while, you get a hunk of, hunk of feta cheese. And when you get a hunk of feta cheese, it's like an explosion. An explosion of fantastic flavor in your within your mouth. It's good. I like it. Recommend it. And because I haven't eaten all, anything all day, and it's like four o'clock, I'm starving. So that makes it taste extra good. I'm gonna take this on my next backpacking trip. I don't know what else to say about it. It's good. It's good. You wanna see another piece of it? Here. It's kind of mushed up. It's kind of mushy. Let's see if I can get it in focus. Hold on. We're gonna go like this. Look at that. Yum, yum. How about it? Looks like baby food. Kinda of like, oop, oops, that's on my pants. Kinda of like diarrhea, but it tastes good. Yeah. Crap. Helicopter going by. That's pretty good. I'm gonna be nice and full when I full up when I'm done with this. You can't see right now, but. There's all kinds of ducks and birds laying around in the grass. And some of them are looking at me. Like they know I'm eating food and they're gonna come steal it. But they don't know that I got a spork. And if they try to take my food, they'll get sporked. This is good stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna take this next time I go backpacking. I'll have to make it myself though. I won't be able to get it from the, the drive-through. All right, woof. I'm getting full up. You know what's next? Next is this.